So let's focus on an example of a differentiable function and let's derive the differential uh, differential of the function. So here is the function y is fx equals x squared. And look at the tangent line in 1. We know that the derivative in 1 equals 2. And now suppose we calculate the differential of this function dy, which is by definition given by the derivative of x times dx, which equals 2 times x times dx. So now we take x equals equal 1. And suppose we get, take a small change in x value dx equals delta x equals 0 0.1 then dy the differential so the estimated change in function value dy is the change along the tangent line so that's dy and this estimate of the precise change in function value, which is delta y, is given by dy equals, now we just substitute the x, x value 1 and dx equals 0 0.1, so we get an actual change of 0 0.2. And for this function, it's not hard to calculate the precise change in function value. So delta y equals the function value in 1 plus delta x minus the function value in 1. So look at the figure, and then here in yellow we indicate the precise change. I'm going from 1 to 1.1. And this can be cal calculated exactly since f1 plus delta x equals 1 plus delta x squared minus 1, which gives 2 times delta x plus delta x squared, which equals 0 0.2 plus 0 0.01, which equals 0 0.21. So you see that there's not so much difference between dy and delta y. Whether or not dy suffices as, a, as an accurate estimate of delta y remains an open problem. This, is also, this also belongs to a more advanced course in calculus.